Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, the third time on the floor to talk about high-level nuclear waste and, and Yucca Mountain. I started talking about Hanford, which is in Washington State, comparing it to the Yucca facility. In Hanford, 53 million gallons of nuclear waste, zero at Yucca. Nuclear waste stored 10 feet underground in Hanford. Uh, waste would be stored 1,000 feet underground in Yucca. Waste 1,000 feet from the water table at Yucca, 250 feet from the water table. At Yucca, the nuclear waste would be 100 miles from the nearest river. Uh, at Hanford, it's one mile from the nearest river. What are the senator's position on Yucca Mountain in Washington State and Oregon, knowing that we have 53 million gallons of high-level nuclear waste one mile from the Columbia River? Uh, senator Cantwell is not supportive of Yucca Mountain. Senator Murray is supportive, at least in her public statements. Senator Wyden is not supportive. And Senator Merkley is silent. Uh, they should not be silent. A couple weeks ago, I then moved to my home state of Illinois and the Zion Nuclear Decommissioned Power Plant that still has high-level nuclear waste on site. Again, the same statistics for Yucca are there in a desert away from a river. Zion is on Lake Michigan. Zion has 65 casks containing 1,135 1, metric tons of nuclear waste. Waste stored above ground, five feet above the water table, 1,300 feet from Lake Michigan. So what do the senators from the, the two states, and, I, and Wisconsin has two nuclear power plants also on Lake Michigan. Well, Sen Senator Durbin is supportive of Yucca Mountain. Senator Kirk is supportive of Yucca Mountain. Senator Cole is supportive of Yucca Mountain. Senator Johnson is still silent on, on Yucca Mountain. I imagine we'll know soon. Now we move to Georgia and South Carolina. Look at the difference here. Savannah River uh, has 6,300 canisters of waste, nuclear waste on site. The waste is stored right below the ground. It is 100, 0 to 160 feet above the water table, and it's right next to the Savannah River. Again, compare that to Yucca Mountain. No nuclear waste. Waste would be stored 1,000 feet underground, 1,000 feet above the water table, and 100 miles from the Colorado River. So where are these senators from Georgia and South Carolina? Well, uh, Senator Isaacson says, we need to retain Yucca Mountain as our nation's high-level waste repository. What does uh, Senator uh, Chambliss, so he supports. Senator Chambliss says, we have long advocated that the Department of Energy immediately halt all actions to dismantle operations at Yucca Mountain. He supports. Senator Graham. No one should be required to pay for an empty hole in the Nevada desert. The decision by the Obama administration to close Yucca Mountain was ill-advised and leaves our nation without a disposal plan for spent nuclear floor fuel or Cold War waste. That's what Hanford is, Cold War nuclear waste from our weapons sector. What does Senator DeMint say? Without Yucca Mountain, America will not have safe and secure place to permanently store nuclear waste and instead waste will pile up at existing reactors. We will continue and I will continue to come down on the floor and go through the nation highlighting high level nuclear waste all over this country when the federal law under the Nuclear Waste Policy Act of 1982 says we should have one site. And the law says that site is Yucca Mountain. And so as we continue to go through the states, Hopefully some senators will get off the dime and, and, and uh, state their positions, culminating to 60 senators in support as we move this forward and this nation forward to a more secure location for high-level nuclear waste away from lakes, away from rivers, away from the groundwater tables. There's no safer place on the planet than underneath a mountain in a desert, and that place is Yucca Mountain. With that, I yield back my time.